So you, you see that little silver thing? What is it? Do you have any idea what this gadget does? Well, that's the whole idea behind this show. It's to identify a mystery gadget. That's why we call it... What the heck is that? Welcome to What the Heck Is That? The new gadget game show. <laughs> Hi, I'm your host, Steve Greenberg, and welcome to another edition of What the Heck Is That? This time we've got a very odd looking small product I'm gonna showcase in just a moment. And our panel of experts are gonna to have to guess what that product is. What the heck is it? That's the whole idea. So first up, let's introduce our panel. We have with us, Miss Lois Whitman Hess. Now, if uh, you're un she's unfamiliar with the stove, has no idea what it does. But when it comes to making a deal, she cooks. The Digi Dame, Lois Whitman Hess. Yeah. Yay! <laughs> Next, moving on to Harry Redlick. Harry bought a new car. He really did. He's renovating his house. He's doing a lot of landscaping. And he's hoping to be on the show to win big cash prizes. Boy, is he foolish. <laughs> Welcome, Harry Redlick. Sorry, Harry, you're not going to win any money. We don't give away money on this show. And last, but certainly not least, he was voted wittiest guy in his high school class. And obviously nothing's changed. He's still the wittiest guy. <laughs> Oliver Toll. Welcome, Oliver. Thank you so much. I'm out of here because I was looking forward to winning cash prize. Uh, no, 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 no. We can talk about it later, but right now there's no cash prize. OK, <laughs> so let's take a look at this product. I'm going to walk over to the, the little stage here just to give a good, good, good look so you can guys see what this looks like. OK, you can see it's got this end of it. And you're gonna have to not only say what it is, but why it was invented, or if there is a why there. So you can see, I'm giving you a good tight look. I'm gonna bring it in a little bit more. Uh huh. Okay, so now we're gonna go off to Harry Redlick. Give me three questions for it. Well, I see some grooved edges um, in, the, in the part that's facing me. So it, does this screw on to something? Yes, it does. Very good. Does it screw onto uh, something in a bathroom? Absolutely could be in a bathroom. It could be. In, is the other end um, a light? No, it is not a light. We move on to Lois Whitman. Pets. OK, um, it's not a salt shaker. So I have to think of what this could be. And, and Harry told us that it, was, it gets screwed on to something. Um, something else. Uh, something else. I am so clueless about this. And you could use it in the bathroom. Yes. Yeah. Hmm. Um, OK. Uh, does it matter who uses this product? No. So it's for everyone. That's not a it's that's not it's a second for, question. <laughs> okay. It's for everyone, correct. Okay. A certain demographic that uses this product? Yeah, I think it's designed for more for one group versus another group. So I would say that's a yes. Okay. Does this product cost less than $50? Yes, it does. Hmm. Okay. With that information, we go on to Oliver Tull. Oliver, Lois has given you some information. Harry's giving you some information. Yes. What are your thoughts? Well, I have a cousin who's a doctor, and I think I've mm -hmm. seen one of these before. Oh. Is, this, is this a suppository of some type? No, it is not a suppository <laughs> of some type, or any type, in okay. fact. Uh, Good question, though. Lois asked if, <laughs> if someone else could use this on you, and that led me uh, down the wrong path. No, no. You have to use this yourself. You can't. Uh -huh. No one can use it for you. So the $50 think. this costs, the less than $50 comes from you, not from someone else. Well, I mean, uh, you, I mean, you have to buy You or someone you know or love has to buy it, and then you can use it. There's the important piece of information. OK, mm -hmm. and third, does this device have GPS capability? No, it does not. Ah. 
Okay, so now we go back for one more round of one question each. Okay. Harry, you've heard all the information. Harry Redlick, what is your thought? What do you think this product is? Um, is it a grooming product? Mm, no, not really, no. Okay, and its purpose isn't, you know, it's more serious than not serious. And there it is right there. Uh-huh. Okay. So, um, Lois, what you have a follow-up question? What's your follow-up question? Um, <clears throat> does this get inserted into your body? No, it does not get inserted into your body. See, I already asked that question. <laughs> I know, I know, but she's wanting to hear that answer again. I don't know. We'll worry about it. Okay, let's go on to uh, <laughs> Oliver, you got one follow-up, and then you're gonna have to go guess. Guess okay. what it is? Okay, but see, the blue velvet is what's throwing me off because I'm thinking like a David Lynch type of thing. No, I just made it to be. You know, I'm, I'm putting all all gadgets are gonna be on the on the blue fur. Blue velvet. Like a romantic light, but uh, okay, is it chargeable? No. In fact, it doesn't have any batteries at all, but. Okay, so now you've gotten some facts there. Okay. This is the moment where you guys have to guess what you think it is. And I'm gonna have to see how they're all doing there. There's, oh, looks like Harry's done. Harry, I'm you're gonna... looking at it. You uh -huh. heard the, you heard, oh, it's a head massager, massage your no. head. Massage head, you know, something that you put oh, massage on. Massage head, oh. You put onto something and it, no. N no, but good guess. That wasn't so much an answer as it was a request. That's right, oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I would like massage and head. Okay. That's right, okay. Moving on to Lois Whitman Hess. <laughs> what do you think, Lois? A toilet, but you got to lower it below your face. Weird. Lois so you have a green screen. A toilet flusher. No, it does not flush the toilet. But it is the bathroom was good. But no, no toilet Amazing. flushing. Amazing. And Oliver Toe. I thought it was a headlight for Ant Man's car. I thought it was that too. Oh, <laughs> uh, no, it's not. Let me go over to the puppet stage and get it. I think you should give us a hint. And let us do it again. You want to, um, it's in the bathroom, mostly for kids. Kids. Okay, how's that? I'm giving you, because Lois requested it, I don't want to hear from her lawyers. <laughs> I'm, 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 I'm going to give you, I'll give you another hint before we get a final answer. It's used mostly in the bathroom, but it could be used in the kitchen too, but mostly in the bathroom, and mostly for kids. In fact, it was invented by a father-daughter team. So the daughter came up with the idea, and you dad, the engineer, made it happen. You screwed onto the shower? You screwed onto something, but not the shower. You screw it onto your faucet when you brush your teeth. Oh, he's getting close. He's getting close, but not there yet. Okay. For washing your Lois? face? Harry Lois, stole Lois? my answer. <laughs> but he said it's not right. Don't this worry. Oh, no, it's not right. Good, good, Harry. Good. <laughs> oh, she loves to get me. Uh, um, oh, hmm. When you take a bath, that's a sprayer. No. So, it, so let's. <laughs> give, I'll give it away. I'll give it away. Yes. You've had some good guesses. So it does screw onto your faucet, and then when you turn the faucet on. This area right here blinks for 20 seconds so that kids know they're washing their hands 20 seconds. Oh, wow. And then it goes solid light when it's, when it's uh, finished in 20 seconds. We have some video so you can see it actually working. And 
again, it was invented by a father and daughter. Uh, I think they're from, I don't think I know for sure. Excellent. Uh, yeah, a really smart idea. They came up with it. To, and, and, by the way, no batteries. What runs it is just the water running through it powers it. So it See, never needs a battery. It, 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 it battery. fits, and it fits most faucets. Not all of them, but most faucets. Like, it's like so Hoover Dam. Excuse me? It's like Hoover Dam. Yeah, right, right, right. It, it, the power is the water, exactly like Hoover Dam. Oh my God, that's, that's a very heady answer there. So this <laughs> is called Sink, Sink Blink 20. You can get it at thinkblink20.com. Uh, and I think if you put in the code blink20, you save, I think, 20%. So it's around 20 bucks or so. Let me see the price on it is. Yeah, you get two of them, actually, for $19. So um, you think to blink20. Blink 182 as you, as you wash your hands. <laughs> exactly, yeah. And, and you know, after this pandemic, you're getting tired of singing happy birthday while you wash your hands. So this does it. I need that for you. Elliot. I need that for Elliot. Okay, we'll get make sure Elliot Just gets one of these. Hands long okay, well, you guys once again did an amazing job. I want to thank you all, and uh, though uh, this did stump you, the guesses were great. I want to tell our viewers if you like this show, please click on the subscribe button. We need subscribers. Just click on subscribe. Come on. You'll see every time we post a new one, you'll get noticed. It doesn't cost you anything. So, uh, anyway, thank you all very much. And once again, we'll next time we come back, we'll have another mystery gadget when we'll all be asking the question, hey, what the heck is that? Right? What the heck is that? So take care, everybody. Bye-bye.